All right, I'm going to do a quick video here of my uh, 2000 Indian Chief uh, Roadmaster. This is a uh, one of the S and S Gilroy Edition Indians, uh, built in Gilroy, California, from '99 to '01. I think they may have crept over into O2 a little bit, but they went with the Power Plus after that, and they kind of went to shit, in my opinion. Uh, of course, I'll probably have some people disagree with that, but you can't beat the S and S engine on the uh, on the early Gilroy edition Indians. The frame geometry was a lot different, and uh, in my personal opinion, here I go again, um, the stretch and the rake makes it really comfortable for a big gangly fucker like me. I'm 6'5", so I got plenty of room on this bike. But anyway, uh, I'll kind of go over some of the specific changes that I made to this bike when I bought it. I bought this bike from the original owner. The uh, bike had 2,600 original miles on it when I bought it. And uh, uh, when I bought it, I basically took it apart and uh, got rid of a lot of the stock uh, things. I put the uh, early vintage Indian fender trim on the front and rear and the little chrome bumper down low. Went with a beehive tail light instead of the big goofy looking tail light and turn signal assembly. Uh, didn't really care for the uh, the stock saddlebags and I mean they're beautiful bags don't get me wrong but uh, they didn't fit what I was going for with this bike with the vintage look so uh, I ordered these new bags uh, with the speed balls kind of the old style. Got a uh, fender rack that I bought and put on it. This is a Corbin Gentry uh, solo seat with a uh, early style chrome grab rail. It's got the rosettes and uh, ran, I'm running five inch tall springs uh, with a, a solo seat kit that I basically made out of steel. Yeah, it works beautiful. Again, S&S motor. Uh, I'm running the stock Indian two into one fishtail, uh, no baffle. I took the uh, stock Indian air cleaner assembly off and went with the old style uh, breather with a uh, star knob enriching a choke knob, put a uh, early style pan head trumpet horn on it to give it more of that old style look. Got a chrome crash bar on it. Stock bars. Just bought these tires a couple of days ago and got rid of the uh, Avon Gangster white walls. I'm not a big fan of white wall tires. I wanted something that looked older, so I, I've got the uh, the Avon. Uh, vintage series, the old pie crust style tires on it now. Really like those. Got the amber running light lenses uh, that are really cool. They give it kind of a more old feel. Uh, bike's a little dusty right now. Uh, it would take a team of full time midgets to keep this thing clean, especially up under those fenders. Oh, let me rephrase that. Uh, little people, I think that's PC. But uh, anyway, kind of not a lot going on over here. Uh, there's your horn. Anyway, let's fire this some bitch up, and I'll show you how it sounds. idea of what a uh, Gilroy Indian should look like. Thanks for watching.